Okay, Paco, this is for you. So, um, what you got here is um, this nylon pink gallon bag. They're about a buck in the hardware store. And yesterday at this time, before the flower was open, I put it on. Now normally I come back first thing in the morning, but I was busy today, so surprisingly I can still pollinate this flower. Now, what I'm going to do here is check for self-fertility. So I'm just taking the pollen from the flower and we can check and see if it still has pollen which of course it will okay okay let's see if we can see the dust see the dust on my fingers all right so that means that this flower produces pollen and so i am just see i'm i'm not gentle about it i just take some of the pollen, pull it off, the pollen sacs, but they're, and just rub it onto the pistol. Oops, I'm trying to do the work and take the video. Okay, so all done. Now, I'll have to replace the bag over the flower. And I will tie it with this green tape once I'm finished here. Now, what am I accomplishing? I'm testing this selection, which is, it, there's a 10 there. I, can't, I don't think you can see it. This is 1310. I'm testing it for self-fertility. So you can take any or all of your selections and do exactly the same thing. Before the flower opens, you put the bag on. Then you, the next day, it's best to do it the first thing in the morning. You go and you do exactly what I just did. You just put the pollen from that flower onto that pistol and seal the bag up. The reason we're putting the bag there is so that bees don't bring in foreign pollen. So if you put it on before the flower opens and then pollinate it with its own pollen and the and this flower matures into a fruit then that selection this 1310 will be self fertile if on the other hand it aborts drops then it's not self fertile it needs pollen from another flower and so once you have verified that you need pollen from another flower then it's easy because you're just you know that flower when it's open needs some other pollen source and you just take that pollen and uh, apply it just like I did a lot of times I'll just grab the pollen from one open flower of a different variety and just rub it just like I did and um, later I'll I'll have more examples of that so I hope that answers your questions, Paco, and we'll see you later.